Okay, here's John's guitar completed. Um, we'll go over the control center first. Um, let's see here. Okay, so what we have here, come around this way. On the control panel, uh, we I added a um, a uh, sorry a Switchcraft three-way, and then also uh, master volume using a, uh, a Sozo .002 with a 100K resistor. Uh, on the tone control, used a Sozo .047. Both parts are 500K CTS. Um, on the bridge, uh, I restrung it in uh, the way Rickenbacker does. What they do is they use the fundamental string on the top and then the octave after it. So typically, uh, this guitar was strung with the octave above and the fundamental below, so we just did it in the Rickenbacker fashion. Uh, these are the Jason Lawler custom toaster tops to fit a uh, P90 route. Uh, we'll get to hear those in just a moment. And this is the, uh, the stringing. Uh, you can see one side is like a standard type, and then they do the, the open part of the headstock here. Uh, I don't know what the tuners are. They kind of look like, uh, like shallows or... Uh, possibly Godos, but not 100% of what they are. Here's the Italian thing. Uh, the guitar uh, is semi-hollow, and it is a set neck. So, pretty nice build. I'm not sure what kind of wood's being used on here, but um, overall sounds pretty good. Um, let's see what else. Okay. Uh, the strings that we're using are Kurt Mangan. This is a custom set of 12-string uh, 12, uh, 12 custom Kurt Mangan set. So we have that going on. And we'll give a listen in just a moment.